Hungry Thursday! Woo! Yeah! Extra! As you saw a couple of days ago, we were at Proper Gastro Pub. We're still here with Tom, but we've also now been joined by Justin, who is the general manager. Oh, governor. Governor, yeah. he's the, the governor. governor. Yeah. Oh, hello, governor. He's the governor. Oh, <laughs> so we're here, and uh, we want to focus a little bit on the pub itself, and they've opened their doors to us, and we're really grateful about that, so we got to uh, give them some play and talk about what a great place this is downtown. As you can see behind us, this is a terrible placement. Yeah. I'm sorry, it's Kelly, location, is this, it's location, I can come up with. Location, location, location. Sorry. Yeah. So we got a great view behind us, the, the Petco Park. I can't imagine how ultimately packed it is on here on like a, a Padre game. Absolutely. It's like the tide comes in and we, we're capacity, we're about 500 capacity here and it fills wow. up in about an hour. That's crazy. Yeah, just like that. Has yeah. anyone hit one end of the restaurant? No, actually little kids that play in the little kiddie park right here have a couple <laughs> times. Yeah. But, uh, Sir, we've lost our ball in your restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> we just chuck it back. We're good like that. Right on. Right on. So now you guys are what we like to affectionately term a 50-50 bar. So not everything on draft is craft, um, but you have an expanding craft tap list uh -huh. and you have a great bottle list. Oh, thank you. Thank and you very so much. We're, we're actually going to be sampling off your bottle list today. We're drinking Avery Salvation, which is a, a tasty beer. So I'll pour for the governor. Yeah, that's uh, Adam's 9% golden ale. It's part of his first trilogy. Adam Avery likes to do trilogy beers. So his very first three that he started with were Salvation, The Reverend, and Hog Heaven which was a barley wine. Yes. And uh, yeah, this is a fabulous beer. And I, I, I agree with Stephen wholeheartedly, you have a great bottle list building here. Yeah, we actually, uh, this is uh, the fourth wine stores location and we're, we're a pub. So what I did is actually contacted all the beer buyers around all the stores and we came up with a 40 bottle list that we're pretty proud of. Cheers, Cheers fellas. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers, Tom. And this is one of my personal faves. It's uh, a little caramelly. It's not too oversweet. Obviously, Avery out of Boulder, Colorado, and it, as Bill said, nine yeah. percent. Uh, it only takes a few to get you going. So. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. It's, it's, a, it's very nice. It's, and a, it's a great. This is a great bottle to share among a few of the people at the table. And get, Absolutely. Get a dinner going. It's almost it's, like a bottle of wine. At the it's table. great pairing with fish, chicken dishes, uh, artisanal cheese plates, which we have, which yeah. you have, which are ama amazing. I was looking over those, and as, yeah, this is a great beer for all those things. Mm -hmm. So um, tell the people, like, I think the biggest issue with this place is going to be parking, obviously. Right. And um, especially this weekend for Comic-Con. Hello. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it's pretty insane. What's that? <laughs> nice. <laughs> we'll deal with you later, sir. Um, <laughs> but uh, so what, what do you, how do you suggest people best get to your location here? Well, the, the interesting thing is we're right on 8th and J, and we actually had to invent the address. <laughs> to get here. So people nice. were our actual address is seven nine five J Street, which is over there, but we're actually truthfully if you get to eighth and J and just keep walking into the park, right. you'll find us. Right. Parking's great when there's not a game day and the nice thing is when there's away games, it's free parking at all the Padre parking lots around here. Nice. So oh, you can excellent. get you can get it for free. So okay. there's plenty of parking, non game days and we'd love to have people come down and uh, say sample the bottle beer collection. And we also have a cask program we're rolling out. And uh, that's going to be probably twice a month. Okay. And I'd like to have people come down and enjoy that too. I'd awesome. say it was really easy to find. Just walked strolling right down 8th, and I saw the big signs for proper outside. Walked right in, walked right in. And down. I think Google Maps, at least on my iPhone, is already like They've tagged your location yeah. and it, it gives you the proper directions to get here. So yep. I'm very excited about the cast program because you're from what, New Zealand? Oh, yeah. shut up. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, gonna... Let's get this Thank man out of the pub, please. Thanks, Bill. I mean, Bob. <laughs> so he's. So, he, he's actually a trained sellerman from uh, family businesses in London. So for those of you who don't know, in England, the, the, one of the main thrusts is camera and the real ale has revitalized the English beer scene over the last 25 years. And so it's all about cask ales. And so Justin's excited because he's bringing on a cask program here. So he's going to have Firkins of fabulous beer from local craft breweries available. So I think that's a really big thing. Uh, absolutely. I, in fact, it, uh, I almost shed a tear when I, I finally I tapped a keg the first time in 20 years, the way I'm used to doing it. No one else knew what the hell was going on, but I'm, I got this like, why, are they, why is that man beating on that, that yeah. keg? <laughs> so it's something we're excited about, and um, we've got a glycol system set up. It's going to keep, uh, hopefully we'll be able to keep the... I'm all about cellar temperature, right. but maybe it will keep the, the beer for probably about another extra couple of days. Yeah, I think so. so. 
And we, we're actually putting on some fantastic beer dinners where we pair five courses with five different beers from different brewers. Uh, we've already used Ballast Point. We're going to be using Stone coming up here for fairly soon. So. Uh, and, uh, the rumor has it that you also have some sort of wine thing attached to this. Is that accurate too? Yeah, well, that's a part of the business. This is actually a, a manifestation of what the owner, Ken Mills, envisaged. He grew up in London and he always wanted to open his own pub. He started off very slowly opening up uh, wine steels, which is pretty uh, well known in San Diego. This is a fourth store, so we have about a hundred different. Um, bottles of wine down in wine stores which you can pick up and you can buy a bottle and bring it up to the upper deck here but truthfully the thrust behind opening proper was to open a pub and that's where i come in that's what i've been doing in my entire life so very excited to be here and rolling out the big beer selection having cast nights is truthfully what we've been driving at and so you know i appreciate you guys coming by and i'm a big us. fan i think it's yeah, awesome and you guys have a good online presence you're using social media very well you can follow these guys at proper gastro pub you also have a Facebook fan page, which is probably, you know, search proper gastro pub. Yep. You guys update that a lot very frequently, so follow that, see what's going on around here. And definitely check this place out, because I think when I'm downtown, this is going to become my new favorite. When you get here, ask for the governor. Ask yeah, for the governor. ask for the governor. So, well, thank you very much, and cheers. cheers and as always, stay safe and drink beer. Yeah, cheers. cheers. cheers.